fucking outstanding. We've got a sniper rifle. I mean, it's a point thirty eight sniper rifle, so hunting rifle if you prefer. But even so, yes, please. Loads of ammo for it now as well because it's thirty eight. Um, you know what? Codsworth. Codsworth. How much we got for this? We've got loads for this. So, oh dear. We're having difficulty negotiating stairs, apparently. It's amazing, Dogme, honestly. It's a bloody floating robot, and yet he can't figure out how stairs work. Sometimes I just don't know what to say. Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she anything but calm. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 4. We're on the roof of a red rocket station where we're armed with a brand new hunting rifle. It's a 38 hunting rifle, so it doesn't pack much of a punch, but it's great because it means I can ditch my pipe rifle and I gave Codsworth back my... Um, Laser musket, because I was previously using the laser musket as kind of a sniper rifle. Uh, but since I've now got this, I don't really need to. Dog. Why? Why you do this? Why you do this? You know I'm trying to, trying to look out that way. Why you do this? Honestly. Silly pooch. Oh, hello. Glad I looked out there. I could hear gunfire in the background as well, but yeah, there's a protect protectron over there. Don't know if it's friendly. However, we do have a sweet rifle now, which is good. Chambered in a round, which is not particularly powerful. However, it is very common, so I don't know why I took the beer bottle. Oh, that was I read, I read bottle, and I thought it said bottle cap for a second there, and I don't. No, no, thank you. Anyway, it's early evening. I can hear gunfire. It's very foggy. It's kind of quite a weird atmosphere we've got going on right now. <coughs> and I just sneezed. Wow. I'm really sure where that came from anyway. So. We could rest here. Um, I feel like pressing on a bit further, though. At least for now. Honestly. But it's good to know that this is here and we can take advantage of it should we need to. Right here. Um, we previously heard a radio distress call um, at the Cambridge Police Station. Someone using a military frequency, which is certainly quite interesting. Oh, weapons workbench. Fantastic. Okay. Um, so we're thinking of checking that out and that might indeed be where the gunshots are coming from. This place is quite good, actually. Is this, what, is this, would this place function as a proper actual settlement? Does it have a, no, it doesn't have a workshop, but it does have a bunch of workbenches and stuff. So this is actually pretty cool, really. Can we, uh, oh yeah. This is a really good place to haul up for the night. Yeah, definitely. Oh, duct tape. Thank God. Yeah, not bad at all. I like it. All right. Well, we might might come back here later then. Um. Weapons workbench then. Very clever. <laughs> God, Swift is amazing. <laughs> um. So it's already got a pretty good receiver. It's got a long barrel. Uh, it's got a full stock. Marksman's stock would be nice, but uh, we don't have any of the stuff for that. We have virtually nothing in terms of actual spare parts now that I think about it, so... Don't even know why I'm bothering. However, a large magazine would be really nice. We've only got standard one at the moment. 
a large magazine would kick ass. What would we need for that? Four screws, five springs, and five steel. I wonder. Codsworth? Ah, uh, that's not Codsworth. Codsworth. What is it, Mum? No, 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 no. I don't. No. That was it. All right then. This whole. Hey. Miss Sally. There we go. Here's what I have. I want all your junk. Here we go. We might have enough crap here. If I just take it all. Ooh. Don't know if it, if I hit take all. I don't know if it, it'll probably take everything off him and not just. Oh, we need gun nut as well. So forget about it. Never mind. Ugh. Is there anything else we can do? It's got a medium scope. We could put standard sights on it if we wanted to. We just wanted a regular kind of bolt action rifle. We could put a bayonet on it. Inferior range, superior bash. And uh, no, not really. If I'm caught using this weapon at bayonet range, then I'm clearly doing something wrong, so. <laughs> Could rechamber it for a whole variety of different rounds. 50 caliber, good grief. Um, God, look. Suppressor would be nice. It'd be very nice, actually. But yeah, put a muzzle brake on this thing and then upgrade it to 50 cal. Oh, man. <laughs> what a rifle you could make. <laughs> oh, life goals in the apocalypse. Anyway, I think it's fine for now. As for this, well. If I had some wood, I could give it a comfort grip. Magazine, no, that's gun nut stuff. Reflex like glass and nuclear material. Yeah. Well, a crossbow. Compound bow. Whoa. Hello. Plasma induction bow. Are you having a fucking laugh? Holy shit. It melts melts projectiles into superheated plasma, dealing bonus energy damage. Whoa! Dude! That is just beyond cool. Can I put loads of stuff on this as well? A scope wouldn't be that bad, actually, for this thing. Night vision scope. Long recon scope. Wow. Bashing stirrup, foot stirrup, adds bashing damage. Yeah, this is better though. Oh, come on. All right, very cool. And for the machete, yeah, we can just do the serrated blade, but we need two ranks of blacksmith to do that. Wow, there's so many perks that we want, but can't have yet. It's annoying. Well, anyway. Let's toddle on, I think, for now. Where do we, where do we want to go? This way. Still gunshots going on, so clearly. Clearly something's going on. Something's up. Visibility is so crap, though, with all this fog. It's a little bit worrying. I'm not going to see shit until it's right on top of me. So there's a protector on around here somewhere who may or may not be hostile. Oh, we're getting closer, all right. But no, I, I'm not in much of a rush to uh, help them out exactly, whoever they are, because they might just try and kill me, so you never know. Preferably, I'd like to let it play out and then just sort of encounter whoever wins, but... Uh, Maybe we won't, we won't get that opportunity. We shall see. Nothing much here, really, is there? Oh, 
Okay, what's the deal with this place? Uh, I see what the deal with this place is. Lots and lots of ghouls. Wonderful. Is there any way we can just avoid all these? I would prefer that. Get parched from lack of water. Oh dear. Let's just go ahead and fix that. Anything else I need to know about? Insomnia. Adrenaline. Purified water. I wonder if... Oh no, never mind, never mind, never mind. Forget I said anything. I was failing to understand how something worked, and then I remembered how it actually works, and therefore, never mind. It's not important. Um, they have laser guns, whoever they are. And a flag. Oh, well, you seem to have everything under control, then. Excuse me. Check your fire. We've got hostiles. Have we? I don't see any. I mean, there's some down there, but... Oh, Jesus. Bits. I'll talk to you in a minute, Mr. Power Armor dude. Thank you for not shooting me on sight, though. That I, I do appreciate that. Um. Hello. You were saying. <clears throat> we appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Um. <laughs> Before I answer, will you tell me who you are? In due time. If you want to remain in our compound, I suggest you answer my question first. I prefer to keep my business to myself. Then, if there's nothing left to discuss, I suggest you leave our compound immediately. I see. You gonna make me or what? Hi. Why don't you just get out of here? Scribe Halen. I don't get you. Apparently, I know Are her you name. The hero or <laughs> She's the got victim? a name tag. <laughs> um. Grateful bunch, aren't they? Definitely, for sure. Paladin dance. Have you decided to cooperate and tell me what brought you here? I'm just trying to survive out here, like everyone else. The way you charged in and engaged those ferals? I find that a bit difficult to believe. Are you from a local settlement? Do all these questions really matter? After all, I helped you fight those ferals. You make a fair point. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. I want to help, but I don't like the secrecy. Who are you really? Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. 
I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may... Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need. The deep range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Who are the Brotherhood of Steel? Our order seeks to understand the nature of technology. Its power. Its meaning to us as humans. And we fight to secure that power from those who would abuse it. Okay. Well. See, I was under the impression you might have been like the US military or something, in which case that would have put me in an awkward position. But, uh, never mind then. This is just a fancy way of saying that you're looting everything you can get your hands on. Looting implies that we're attempting to benefit ourselves. That couldn't be further from the truth. He said while so, wearing power armor. <laughs> what do you say? Will you help us? Mm, well, don't seem like a particularly well-adjusted bunch of individuals, but they've got some nice hardware, and are you ignoring me for a reason? <laughs> Preston did make a very good point previously when we bumped into him the first time where he said you can't have too many friends in the Commonwealth so maybe we should help them out it's a good plan if we make it back I can assure you that I wouldn't undertake this mission unless I had confidence in your abilities Halen, take Reese inside and bind his wounds yes sir Reese, once you're on your feet I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure I'm on it alright civilian, it's time to prove your worth Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out, people. All right, big guy. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Perks! More importantly than anything else. Uh, right. Oh, yeah. Now we can make some vodka. All right. Fantastic. Do I have any more perks? That's just the one. Okay. Lovely. You guys don't mind if I just grab that? Thank you. So you're just gonna head inside and leave the exit completely unguarded. Um. Well, you know, I'm no soldier, but that seems like a bit of a poor tactical decision to me, but okay. Fine. It's kind of getting dark right now, actually, to be honest with you, so maybe we should go inside. Let me just, uh... <laughs> make sure I've looted everything. <laughs> yeah, that'll do. Oh. Ah, never mind. And those. Very good. me up or what? I don't know. Your prognosis looks pretty grim. Might be more the textures. Oh god, please load faster. <laughs> That's better. You're all heart, doc. Just quit squirming so I can get these bandages on. Well, you did say resupply yourself. I'm gonna take that as grab whatever's not na nailed down, you know? <laughs> 10 millimeter pipe pistol, eh? Let me just... I'll have that. Thank you very much. Uh, inactive distress pulsar. I don't know what to do with one of those just yet, so I'll leave it alone for the minute. Do 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 desk. I think this is a common sight these days. Huh? I'm sure some would even call this clean. <laughs> Heads up. I'm assuming, Cosworth, you don't approve of my all my bricks and uh, dead leaves all over the floor of my house. Well, I don't either, really, unfortunately, so. Um. 
Oh, I forgot to give you back all this junk, didn't I? No wonder I'm overloaded. There you go. Doop, 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 doop. Uh, no, I don't really want any moot fruit unless they've got a chemistry bench around here somewhere and I can I brew it into some sort of alcoholic beverage, in which case, fine, but. Do, do, do. You think Paladin Dance is wondering why I just keep running around grabbing desk fans? Hoarding now? Yep, hoarding indeed. And you can carry a bit more of this for me in a minute as well, actually, Codsworth. If you don't mind. I actually looked up what Jet does in the game at the moment, and it actually slows down time. So... It might actually be not the most useless drug ever. So on that note, I think I might actually just um, grab that. Oh, there we go. Another dust fan. Do 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 do. Guana bits. Nah. Super thought antifreeze. I'm overloaded again. Combat shot. Hello. Ooh, hello. Let me have a look at these. Buff out as well. Military fatigue. Is that the same as what I've got? Well, I had. I think I've taken it off. Well, I've dumped it anyway. Um, no. These ones give you an agility bonus, apparently. They're also kind of filthy. Uh, let's go back to that. Do, 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 do anything else? Handcuffs. No, I don't think we need handcuffs. Oh god. Loot faster. Detonate. Detonator! Oh yes, now I just need to find some explosives. Buff out, more jet. I uh, don't really need mentats. Don't need those. Holotype. Hello team. Captain Whitmark here. Welcome to the task force. Operation Winter's End starts now, with you. Together, we will knock Eddie Winter off his throne and dump his sorry ass in a 2,000 volt easy chair. It should come as a surprise to no one that our operations in Heads Boston up. have been, in a word, compromised. Winter has eyes everywhere, even the BPD. Oh, yeah. At like the end of the tape, guess it was. Uh, what do we got? So let's have a look. Thirty-eight tracer pistol, auto long, quick eject. Blah, 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 blah. Oh bloody hell! Okay, it's basically a submachine gun. That's kind of cool, actually. Um, heavy bayoneted hunting rifle. Ooh, with a reflex sight. But uh, an ammo type that I have virtually nothing for. Um, okay. Oh my word, hello. Sorry, just testing out guns, it's fine. Don't, don't panic. Oh my word. That is, this is a nice bit of key. This pistol's really good. Um... Slightly less damage, but it's got a better sight and it's more accurate and it's not got as much range actually, but we can fix that. Alright, I'm gonna hold on to that. And then there's this combat shotgun as well. <sighs> this could also be really useful. Right, okay, you know what? 
Let's make you four. Look alive. Something you need, Mum? What's mine is yours, Mum. Right. Weapons! Alright, so you can have that. And that. That. And you might as well hold on to the detonator while we're here, actually, as well. I don't need that for anything else just yet. Um, okay, good. That leaves me still a little bit on the over-encumbered side. Well, you know, like on the brink of it, so I should probably see if I can hand over something. Else. You know what? Oh, God. You know what? I don't want to give you the gas mask because I'll just forget to take it off you again at some point and then I won't have it anymore. Uh... Could chow down on some radstag, that would help us, but not only temporarily, that's the problem. Uh, probably, yeah, I should probably hand you some ammo that I don't have any guns for. God, these flares are quite heavy, aren't they? Bloody hell. Yeah, you better take bunch of those and these fusion cores uh, you know what? I don't have a lot of shotgun shells do I actually at the moment so you know what I better give you this shotgun because it's not much good if I've only got 13 shotgun shells is it all right can you actually Oh, yeah, you can see out the windows in this game. Very good. Lots of little improvements in Fallout 4 that I think people take for granted, actually. Especially when you compare it versus... Uh, for example... Military-grade duct tape. Hell yeah. Especially when you compare it this game versus Skyrim. Um, I think what a lot of people do is they compare this game against, myself included obviously, but I think what a lot of people do is they compare this game against Fallout New Vegas, and definitely as an RPG it comes up quite short versus New Vegas. But, if you compare it against Skyrim, this game actually improves a fuckload of stuff, like, really does. I mean, people in the first couple of videos of this that I've uploaded so far have left, you know, as you would expect, quite a few droll little comments about oh, trying to roleplay in a game that... trying to roleplay in Fallout 4, it won't let you. <laughs> but here's the thing, I have successfully roleplayed the shit out of Skyrim, and that is a game where whose dialogue system consists of Look alive. one what option 90% of the time, literally. Like, if you... If you follow my Skyrim series and you, you watch the, one of the videos I put out recently where I'm talking to... Um... Valerica, I think was the name of the NPC, um, as part of the Dawnguard questline. I have an entire conversation that lasts about five or six minutes, I would say, and the entire conversation is literally one option. One option. One option. One option. One option. The entire way through. And so people, like, give this game's dialogue system shit, but frankly, compared to the, what Bethesda have previously put out, it's actually a huge improvement. I wish I knew what that did. But anyway, that's my little rant over. Excuse me, Paladin Dance. You ready to move out? Why establish an outpost at the police station? Given the nature of the facility, we felt it would be tactically advantageous to search it for weapons and ammunition. The radio tower on the roof was an unexpected boon, but it obviously has its shortcomings that need to be rectified. It might not be as imposing as the Citadel back in the Capital Wasteland, but it suits our purposes. That's all I'm willing to divulge at this point. Are you ready to proceed with the mission? I, I question the sense in setting up a police station because there might be guns and ammo there. 200 years later. I mean, think about it. Right after 
the nuclear war actually happened, places like police stations are going to be like quiet. the first places that were looted for guns and ammo. Like, think about it. The odds of a police station in an area like this actually having any guns and ammo left after 200 years is just, like, next to none. But, ugh, whatever. I think so. I'm not sure. I need you to do whatever it takes to be combat ready. Gather anything you need from the police station so we can be on our way. Dance. You ready to move out? Mm, actually, not yet. Not yet. Get yourself together. We've got a job to do. <laughs> Think you're some Keep kind of hot shot? If you could just stand still while I'm talking to you, please. It would really be a huge favor. You should pay attention. You might learn something. Listen, smartass. I don't take advice from anyone except Top. You're hired help, and that's all there is to it. Hired help or not, I got the job done. Got some backbone. Good. You'll need it if you keep hanging with us. Now why don't you run off and see if Top needs you to do anything else? Whatever. Oh, there was a terminal back there that I didn't look in, wasn't there? I should probably do that. Sorry first. about the other guys. Why are you cutting me so much slack? I uh I joined the Brotherhood not too long ago. They used to be like you. Wandering alone. So I know what it feels like when every single person you bump into sticks a gun in your face. Look, it may not seem like it, but Dance is a good man. He's just all soldier. Protocol is his bread and butter. And Reese? Well, let's just say he's as hard-headed as a Mr. Gutsy. But you know what? I trust both of them with my life. Because they're good people. And that's hard to come by nowadays. Okay. Mm, all buff out. Get in. Hot plate. Yeah. Doopity doopity. Oh, damn it, really? Seriously? Are there any other way in there? Yes, good. Okay. I was worried there for a minute. Oh, that goes onto the roof. Okay. Well, not really. We don't really want to go up there. Uh, so. Alright. Right, I'll check out these terminals and then we'll talk to Dance. Um, Why right. are you standing around here like there's nothing to do? Uh, Dance is waiting for you. Yeah, yeah. I'm just one of two things. Apparently, they're using the computer right now, so never mind. Also, there's the motor pool down here. Let's go check this out. Hold on. Wow, it's basically just an overblown garage. Do we really need this long to load it? For God's sake. Tick tock. Don't make me have to go back and edit this after the fact. Okay, right, there we go. Oh, very good. Glad I came in here. Oh, economy one to glue, and I believe that's a cap stash. Hell yeah. And a power armor thing. Rack, whatever you want to call it. Oh, okay. That's why it was such a long loading screen. Yeah. Alright, fair enough. Okay. Where the hell was that computer? Sure, it was around here somewhere. There was, yeah, I know there's that one over there. But, oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Uh, no, that's a dead computer. Where was the? Where was the other one? I'm not imagining things, am I? I'm pretty sure there was another computer here somewhere. Perhaps I am imagining things. I have no idea. No, here we go. Here we go.
style. Yeah. Do these things give you back attempts, or is that just the other games? It used to be the case that if you click the brackets, it would sometimes give you back more attempts at unlocking the thing. But I'm not sure if that's still the case. It just seems to remove duds. Alright, what do we got? Uh, style, likeness 1, still, likeness 1. So it's either the S or the I, or the T even. Or the L. Um... Could. Bollocks. <laughs> yeah, it's locked me out. Is it going to reset? Oh, come on, please. Here we go. Black. Nope. Lord. There we go. <laughs> Got lucky eventually. All right. Uh, Holbrook Sedition Logs. Evidence log entry, blah, blah, blah. Object, one-time statement of Mr. N. Friedrichs. Transfer to... What's his face? One-time's pamphlet, Your Rights at Work, recovered from suspect's desk. Transfer to Federal Officer. One-time's pamphlet, You Nionize Today. Wow, okay. Yeah, lovely place pre-war America, wasn't it, clearly? You could be locked up for having a pamphlet. Just wonderful. Um, and you wonder why Sally decided to switch to the other side. <laughs> uh. do, 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 do. Adam's public intoxication logs. One set of clothes abandoned at sea. <laughs> Two times bottle platinum inebriator beverage. Transferred to trash. Winter holiday logs. Turn to Agent Mitchell. Mail to. Okay. Nielsen reckless endangerment logs. Two times spool, 200 in. Uh, 200 foot copper cable. Three times fission pal home nuclear reactors. <laughs> One times bag containing rem remains of TJM home stereo system. <laughs> what? <laughs> Sally, I do believe you took that terminal what for. Yes, yes I did. Thank you for the encouragement, Codsworth. Oh, thank you for finding me a desk fan as well while you were at it. Anyway, um, I'll be with you in a second, Dance, I swear. Just just Stuck one more minute. Too damn long. I'm itching to see some real action. Yeah, you just... You just got some and you got fucking injured, you idiot. Um... Oh, there it is. It's over here. Okay. You God, I'm a scatterbrain today. It's not a... Oh, hello. Proceed to the area designated as the Commonwealth to perform a standard long-range recon operation, LRRO. Report any unusual activity using standard long-range communications to scabbard. Extraction time undetermined. Oh my word, he's got a whole set of personal logs in here. The Commonwealth have been chosen to immediately search the Boston region with the intention of finding secure buildings to use as our recon headquarters. Mike Keane's power armor was destroyed and we lost some of our supplies. Unfortunately, fortunately, we were able to repel the, the attack and continue our mission. Secure building, police station. Structurally sound, defensible. Vega factory is a possible site containing viable pre-walker technology. Not now that I'm done with it. <laughs> Anything I haven't looted was exploded, so... <laughs> 
We initiated a sweep and retrieve operation. Had doors to a site survey and you discovered it was being held by a large force of raiders. Not anymore. Gave the go-ahead and we attempted a breach. As we approached, our squad was hit with gunfire. Night Warwick was injured, so I decided to fall back to Cambridge. Are you f***ing kidding me? So I'm me... A Mr. Handy robot and a dog managed to clear out the entire Corvega factory where a bunch of dudes in power armor failed. Wow, you guys suck. You really do. Oops. Overdose of painkiller. Put them to rest. And paralyzed internally bleeding. The casualty state grid reference blah 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 this area contains the ruins of boston international airport and fort strong the airport was almost completely abandoned but uh, fort strong turned out to be infested by super mutants we were hoping to resupply at the armory there but night sergeant Dawes was killed this is the second location i've had to order a retreat from since we arrived and the third member of my team to die i recommend a complete bombardment of this location in the future unusual energy readings on her instruments she claims that they're on an extreme high band spectrum frequency, which makes it highly unlikely to be pre-war in origin. The readings are also highly sporadic, only appearing for very short amounts of time, and in very specific locations. The decay on these signals is severe, and they seem to disappear off Halen's instruments after several hours. We don't have the equipment necessary to track these readings, so we're attempting to use triangulation to discover their point of origin. Now that is interesting. We've been attempting to contact Scabbard with the energy reading Halen has collected, but the police station's high-gain antenna was damaged by a super mutant rocket attack, and we can't transmit the data. Halen is attempting to repair the antenna, but she isn't certain that we have the parts we need at this time. Good okay. idea to keep Paladin dance waiting. Right, yeah, okay, fine, you made your point. Paladin. You ready to move out? Ready. Outstanding. Follow me, and try not to lag behind. See, it's kind of funny. I always thought that would be the way you'd put the helmet on in power armor as opposed to stepping into it like... I mean, I get that you'd step into the armor, but not the helmet. Still attached to the armor. I always figured you'd jump, you'd climb into the power armor and then you'd put the helmet on yourself. But um, it's not the way it works in the game. Well, apparently it works for him, but whatever. Because the way it looks when it's animated, when you're climbing into the power armor, it looks as if the helmet is actually fixed to the armor. Like, you can't take it off, but you clearly can, so... I don't know. I'm wittering about useless, stupid crap at the moment, aren't I? So... Oh, well. We'll take this alley. Follow me. I'm having a bit of flashlight envy at this moment in time. Park Jet is a short hike to the west. Take this road. We should be able to avoid the larger packs of ferals infesting Cambridge. Traveling this far from the police station is a risk. But getting that transmitter up and running needs to be our top priority. If it was up to me, I'd relocate my team. But Scribe Halen detected some disturbing energy readings in the area that need to be investigated. We don't know much about them, except that they're short-lived and broadcast on a frequency only attainable with a high level of technology. We're concerned that whoever or whatever is creating those energy readings might be a potential threat. So it's our job to investigate. In the middle of the night? Well, it's a good thing I've got insomnia, isn't it? Jesus, well, I mean, having to live in this world would give anyone insomnia, wouldn't it, really? Who the fuck were these people? Caravan gun. Raider fr- <laughs> uh, Nice trousers. <laughs> it might surprise you to learn that my recon team isn't the first to visit the Commonwealth. Over the last seven years, two other teams were sent here by the Brotherhood to gather technology. The first team's mission was a huge success. They came back with crates full pre-war artifacts and historical documents. The second wasn't so fortunate. Shortly after they arrived, we lost contact with them. 
and they haven't been heard from since. As far as my team goes, we've lost four good men to this godforsaken wasteland. They've been a target from the moment we arrived. But despite our setbacks, I don't intend to give up and head home. Or end up missing. Okay. Did we just, like, you know, shoot an innocent caravan guard back there? Because that's, like, not cool. Military camp. Yeah. Hello there, sir. I'm afraid I don't have a ticket for you. Well, a Brotherhood of Steel paladin, a dog, a communist spy, and a Mr. Handy all walk into a bar. What? Nothing to say, Codsworth? You're the master of jokes. Are we going to get there anytime soon, Dan? This is taking a while, man. What the heck? Some sort of encampment over there. What is that? Explosions? What the fuck? I was gonna say it almost sounded like fireworks, but what the deal? Something's going on over there. Oh, no scoped. Get wrecked. Yeah, I, I think let's pick up the pace, Dance. You were the one who was having a go at me for not being able to keep up, for God's sake. Whoa, hello. the place. I hope so. Getting a bit bored of walking. There it is. Arc jet systems. There shouldn't be any exterior security. So we'll head in through the front. I hope I'm getting rewarded for this. I'll take the booze. Yeah, don't mind me, Dancer. I just, you know, I'll be straight with you. I have a little bit of a drinking problem, but it's totally under control, honest. Wow. Couldn't turn off the high beams there for a second, could you? Jesus. We're going in? What's going on? Could you pl- no, never mind. Paladin dance. Listen up. We do this clean and quiet. No heroics and by the book. Understood? Why are we at ArcJet again? We're here to retrieve a device that will boost the signal from the radio tower at the Cambridge Police Station. Without it, we can't make contact with our superiors. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. Can't promise that, my friend. like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. They exploited technology for their own gains, pocketing the cash and ignoring the damage they'd done. Oh yeah, well we're on the same page when it comes to corporations. It appears as though the facility's automated security's already been dealt with. I'll make a communist of you yet, Dance. Don't you worry about it, mate. Got a dog, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she anything but calm. Bomb. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want her to be. 
A million times hotter than TNT.